Yeah, okay, action, real life, no acting. This is not a rerun, we really what's happening. The son of the headline, she the main attraction. LJ, baby, and me, we just a casting. Shannon family matters, the household name. I hope you get the picture with or without the frame. You may agree to disagree on how we do things. It all register, we know we do for change. But, but on the hunch, this is not your Brady Bunch. It's no script, no pretend, and no kind of stunt. This is the ups and downs, real deal, one on one. Appreciate all the love everywhere it's coming from. And that's that, so welcome to a real show. Uncensored, blood, raw, wretched, and cut though. This is not your regular, ordinary show. This in the family matters, not the winds, lows, what? Yes, fam, what it do? Vlogmas day 17. Y'all already know, man, we making it, dog. We moving, we moving, we moving fast. But yeah, I brought y'all here today um, to reveal our 11s. That's right, our Retro Jordans 11s. A lot of people been wanting us to do reviews on, on the shoes, but I'm just gonna do the 11s to show you guys that we have been getting them. We are not just starting to get them like other people who just feel like, oh, it's Christmas coming around or I never had a pair, I'm trying to get them. We have been getting them. We're not going broke getting them. You feel me? We already, listen, bro. We already had a goddamn a mutual agreement with Jordan. <laughs> you feel me? Like, I put all my whole family on Jordans, to be honest. I've been getting my Jordans since I was in school. Like they say, I used to fucking bump candy, bro. Meaning sell candy at school, bro, to get Jordan money, to get my Jordans. Because I know my parents wasn't buying me no hundreds hundred some dollar shoes back then you feel me so i had to do what i had to do and that's what i did you feel me um i got it from the mud so i'm gonna reveal that um that to you guys today um from the jordan of uh, jump man's um space jams to the 11 lows you feel me even though i ain't get them but my son got the lows i got them for him and my daughter but um yeah me and shan um and the kids as well you know all the jays that we got i'm gonna reveal the space jam to y'all that came out in 09 when he had the 23 on the back versus now today he got the 45 on the back but you're gonna see those in lj size we sold eyes because like shan said in the last vlog they was too bulky so we had ended up selling eyes on ebay and got like 300 a piece for them when we only paid at that time it was like 120 in 09 you know you're gonna see the difference i'm gonna show you both difference and it was all the same for every size they had on um, whatever number they had on the back that was on every shoe for big kids or from grown men to little kids so as you go, you're gonna see on the space jams it was a uh, 20 shan texting me on the space jam it was um 23 back in 09 he had 23 on the back of him but now today like i said in 2016 he has 45 on the back but i'm gonna show you but yeah we're gonna start with um <clears throat> retro gammas if y'all didn't know what the retro gammas was they was the all black with the teal jump man sign on the back first we have mine um and as we go along you're gonna see lj didn't have that many 11s because like we said he strang them up too tight and you see how it has the little hoop that it goes through lj used to string them up so tight that he pop it so we like we're not spending a hundred almost $200 on some space jams for him for him to pop the shits in like a week. You feel me? So he didn't get these. It was just me, Shan, and baby. There goes Shan's. As you can see, he got 23 on the back. So sooner or later, probably next year, he probably changed the number on the back. We got these like two years ago when they came out for um, Christmas. And then we have babies. Yeah, babies. So as you guys can see, man, we've been Jumpman heavy, bro. Been Space Jam, been Retro Jordan. We got different retros, but I'm just showing y'all the 11s because right now around Christmas, these all the ones that they done came out with around Christmas time. You feel me? So that's the Gammas. Now for the next, for the next 11s, that came out we have the bricks that came out around Christmas time one of these years that passed I think last year oh no like 
This is around like 2010 though when we got these. Or uh, 2009, we got these around the same time we got the gamblers. The breads that came out as well. See, we got out a couple of years ago. We didn't just get them when they came out this year. We already had them. As you can see, they all kind of, mines ain't really scuffed up because I take care of my shit, but Shan shit for instance. Dirty as hell, scuffed up. <laughs> This is why I don't get them Jordans, bro. Because they don't know how to take care of them like I do. They want me to take care of the whole house with shoes. Like, I'm a shoe man. Nah. Hell nah. I take care of my own shit, so take care of your own shit. This Shan's on. And then this is babies. And you have babies. And like I said, as you can see, LJ is not gonna have many. Because he don't know how to take care of these shits. He fuck them up. He got a few. He got three of them. Right? These are the bricks. Then you have LJ 11s. See how he scuffed them up? These came out last year Christmas. It would have seemed like he got the same damn shoe this Christmas. So I got him the 12s. That's black at the top and white at the bottom. This year. Very rough. Uh, they go skiing on the concrete and his shit. So that's why he don't get these often. That's LJ 11s. Alright, then we have the 11 um, concourse in which only me and baby got them. 11 concourse. Then if you look back on the video when baby was uh, like coming up on a year old. If you look back on the vlog, she was looking at the shoes. If you look at our memorable pictures, you'll see um, I flashed this scene where she looking down at her shoes. And it was these. <laughs> yeah, long time ago, and baby five now. So you could just imagine this the time that we got these. Four years ago. This is nothing new to us getting these Jordans, man. Not going broke getting them, just know that. We've been getting them. Besides this, like two years back, LJ got the 11 loads when they came out. Him and Baby got the 11 loads for school when they came out. See how rough LJ is, man? And that's what we was talking about. See how he popped it? If you look close, you can't see because it's black. This thread coming out because, see how the thread coming out? You can't really see because it's like black. But yeah, he like, I don't know what nigga was chewing on this shit or what. But yeah, that's that. That's why he don't get them that much. For real, can't do it. Yeah, baby got it. Then we got these 11s, the snakeskin 11s, snakeskin 11 lows. Last but not least, I'm going to show you the up-to-date Space Jams with the 45 on the back and then I'm going to reveal LJ's uh, Space Jams back when he was like, like six years old. You feel me? And you're going to see the difference with the 23 on the back back then and that he changed it to the 45 now. So you guys know mine just came in the mail a vlog or two ago. As you also know, we went to the mall and cop Shan's on and she put them on on the vlog a two ago. You feel me? Now you see it, Space Jams. Right now to reveal LJ Space Jams when he was little. And he fucked them up too. LJ Space Jams when he was little. It's a size 12. And now as you can see, 23 on the back and 45 on the back. Same shoe. LJ just had these when he was six years old. We sold ours. Like I said, um, it was too bulky for us so we sold them. See, Space Jam, as you can see, it got the blue jump man. Not a game, bro. 
Blue Jumpman, Blue Jumpman. It's the same damn shoe. So around the time he had these out, back when LJ was six years old, I was uh 25. And we had them too. You feel me? So 15 years later, this man dropped Space Jams again and we buy them. 23 on the back, back then, now today, 45 on the back. So as you guys can see, we have been Space Jam kings and queens around here, bro. Princess and Prince. Hey, we been doing it. We been doing it, man. So when y'all see us get J's, don't be alarmed. Don't think we showing out. Don't think we buying them just because. Don't think we broke after we buy them. Like most people, when you see people getting Yankee goddamn candles, that mean, yeah, them boys lights off because they wanted to go get some damn $200 shoes that was they damn light bill money. But you would never see us with no goddamn candles after a pair of Jordans come out. I bet everything on that, you feel me? I mean, like I said, I ain't trying to brag, but I'm just letting y'all know that, bro, we been doing this shoe game shit, bro. We got Jordans galore, retros. No other kind of Jordans. I'm talking retros, the numbers. I ain't talking about all these team Jordans and all that bullshit. I'm talking about the shit that he put up for three hundred dollars, two hundred dollars a pop. You feel me? And I, like I said, that's just what we do. That's just what we do. That's what I turned my family on to. You feel me? Um, it's just a fashion that we we in the shoe game that we go by. We don't want no other shoe. If we do, um, it's because well, if LJ do, it's because. That's just the type of shoe he wanted. But other than that, only Jordans get bought in this house. That's pretty much it. Jordans, you may have one or two LeBrons, cause LJ get them. Or I might like a certain pair of LeBrons, but it's just like my feet is made for a certain type of shoe. You feel me? My feet, that's how I go by buying my shoes. But it's always gonna be Jordans. Cause they comfortable to me. They, they fit my foot right, they look right in them. You know how some people's shoes, you be like, bro, them shits don't look right. You feel me? Like, your feet don't go with them shoes. Like, your feet is Adidas, or your feet is, is Reebok brand, or your feet is Nike brand. Mine's is Jordan brand. You feel me? That's just me. Who cares? That's my feet. You feel me? That man, I just want to show y'all the um 11 game. You feel me? That we've been doing it, man. Retro 11s all day. Um... Every time they come out, and that's that. So um, back to our regular schedule program. This is gonna be a short vlog for 17. Um, I just got home. The only thing I'm gonna do is make rice for the kids, and cause I made beef stew yesterday. Um, and that's what we're gonna do to school tomorrow too. What? That's not what we gotta go to school anymore. Why? He just said. Okay. He said, he said, oh, no, no, no. He said, we made no sense for you to go and then. Yeah, so he said. Okay. Bath and Body Works candles. Gave us holiday sparkle. It smells so good. Um, I gave a candle, so I got my candle back for our white elephant. So I did white elephant and this one girl um, got a gift and the other girl didn't like coffee so she gave it to the other girl and then I mean she could have traded with me I would have gave her the foot massager but she gave it to the doctor our other doctor so I ended up just saying here you can have my foot massager from my white elephant because I felt bad because she had to take her gift back because the girl didn't want it and even though I wanted the foot massager I was just like take it because I felt bad whatever so um, let's go see how my beef stew looked last night i'll have to cook um, they destroyed my living room so i gotta clean up the living room um so yeah that's my beef stew i got carrots onions everything in it um, so now i'm about to make rice and get baby i'm gonna get them to clean up this living room or whatever and then I'm gonna mop the floor it's kind of dirty now so yeah if you guys want to watch me get started we could do that you can watch me clean here we go
stealing my rice. All right, guys. Um, I'm about to finish cleaning up. This battery is about to die. So we will see y'all at Vlogmas 18, almost close to Christmas, guys. So yeah, that's what I'm gonna do, finish cleaning up. Uh, get these kids ready for bed, get myself ready for bed because I gotta be to work at 7 a.m. So, peace, guys. <laughs>